So I'm working on Toastmasters. And I've just logged into Free Toast Toast, which is our VIC Toastmasters Club website. And I've discovered through my research on Easy Speak, I've had a lot of windows open on Easy Speak because I'm checking out some of the issues that have come up. And as your super user, as your IT, Easy Speak IT representative, I'd like to show you how this works so that somebody else, BPPR, can get into our website and do a little bit of work. Now, at the moment, I will just keep these in close because I haven't read them. You can, we can talk about that another time. Now, I have just logged in as an admin. You have to log in when, to get access into the page. And so now I have logged in as a site admin. So I have the rights to edit the areas here. This is what the page looks like now. And I've discovered through the tutorial on Toastmaster on Easy Speak that we can add our own information to the club website. So that's what I want to have a look at here. And I was just in the meeting information directions here on this page. And there is text here. So now I'm going to click this pencil button to edit. And it shows me the text that is in the box on the web page with the Gmail account where people can reach us when they go to this website. Now, I am going to add the page information from Easy Speak and That is this here. I will save it. And check it. And if that works, it's a Yoohoo. Well, I think it's doing a replace instead of a, here we go. Okay, now save. And close. And I'll open the site again or maybe it'll show it to us now so for more information visit us here and it goes to easy speak how's that is that what you want yeah okay decide if that's what you want it's like that now i've already saved it so if you want to change it back we can do that and i can show you how just the reverse process the other thing i want to let you know here is on the easy speak website you can edit the page layout we are on the vic toastmasters website on our own club website from easy speak and i might have to go into the club control panel to see who's got access there but i believe it must be the president perhaps vppr actually i once i printed out charts to show all of that and gave copies of that to maria Teresa, but i don't have it in my head and i didn't keep the printed copies so that's something to check out. But if you go to, to Easy Speak Home and you see edit page layout, then you are the one. You are the one who can edit the website for VIC Toastmasters Club. And we can add any one of the other links that are available. When you go into the Easy Speak help screen, you can find lots of other information that we can do to tailor our free toast host site for example, to add, if we want to, the members. I don't believe that you do. I think you'll want to remain as anonymous as you have been until now. But the club calendar, for example, instead of just being empty here like that, the club calendar, I will do that now. Edit. Let's see, where do I do that? 
Do 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 do. Um. Main menu. I think I better go back to the admin console and see where I can go. So these are the different areas that we can change website settings, email contact form. Let me see what's here. Meeting info direction, social links, access, statistics about. Okay, let's see. Uh, meeting agenda. Okay, these are the templates. Wow. Here you can have, <clears throat> okay, I'll have to look at the, the information from Easy Speak again. I thought it might be just an easy step to add the calendar. Um, it's not straightforward. You need to invest a little bit of time. So I, I didn't want to discourage you. I wanted to just show you what is possible. So perhaps I'll just stop here and do another short one next time. That's it for now. Um, close. And let's stop the share and stop the recording.